Uh, this is the dual invitational here for Quake Champions. Two groups today, which will essentially be two individual double elimination tournaments. Uh, one player from each group making it through into tomorrow's games, where Claws and Kilson are already lying in wait. Those two groups are pretty savage, it pretty much has to be said. I mean, this promises to be a pretty mad group with only one person making it through. That, to me, is what makes this so savage. You know, it, yeah. it's, a, it's a cutthroat business here. It is. Um, in these kind of brackets when it, only a, a certain amount of players can go through. And then Group B looks to be even more ridiculous because we have Cooler, Razy, Cypher, and then Pulsarizer. Well, you're going to be facing either Cypher or Razy, who will obviously be playing next, so you'll get to watch their game as well. Do you have a gut feeling right now of which one of them you would prefer to face? Uh, I don't know. I prefer Razy because Cypher is uncomfortable for me as a player style. I think this is the reason. He said it himself in the interview, he'd rather fight Razy because he finds Cypher's playstyle very uncomfortable. And you almost feel like Cypher's uh, extreme aggression and lack of fear, you know, complete lack of fear can almost sometimes go against the way Cooler plays. And, you know, there's definitely another player in the business that knows how to play unconventionally, and his name is Razy. Best of luck to both of you. We'll see what happens this time around. Head to your stations, gentlemen. These guys, of course, last met at PGL, haven't really seen much of each other since. So is this going to be the same story, or are we going to be able to turn a little bit of a twist in this tale? Analysts, over to you. Who do you think's going to start? There's a lot of storyline riding on this set, and you know both players definitely want to get this. This run back. Cypher definitely has a lot to prove here. Both players are actually looking pretty healthy. Cypher got more health, Razy's got more armor, but here comes the first exchange. Razy pretty low. But his LG so solid. 15 points of health left, but Cypher will be the first one to drop a frag. Definitely a matchup of who can out LG who. That's a bit of damage from bottom. Yeah. Pushing Cypher up into the air, the dual LG, oh so much pushback. Crazy, doing a good amount of damage, Cypher in the air. And down he goes, didn't even manage to pick up the heavy armor. DJ guaranteed frag. There is a dire roll, but speaking of which, Cypher tries to ambush, but that's big risk, big reward. Point oh. is super weak, but Razy gets the point. Set a trap, and Cypher knows where he is, though. No ability used. But Razy is going to get the combination of grenade he needed. 50 damage on the grenade, finish it off the rail, that's a two piece that Cypher's not going to be happy about, and now he's been forced in a horrific position! <laughs> Knocked back onto the jump pad. Bit of damage coming out, Cypher's still lingering around. Oh, that was actually perfectly executed by Razy. If he knows he's stuck in the air, he tries to stick that one little chunky section on his bridge, so that Cypher couldn't get an angle for the dire orb. That was just next level. And that will be Razy taking map one. Next one will be Corrupted Keep, the map that at one point was known as Razy's Keep is actually Cypher's pick. So, wonder if he knows something that we don't. Very, very curious about this to see. Now the uh, shoe's on the other foot. Razy's gonna try and slow himself down and, and rush it massively. And that was a good choice indeed as he now sees his Cypher. Yeah, there we go, the ability has been used. This is not good for Razy. Didn't use it aggressively, didn't use it defensively either. Time for Wasted Ghost Hall, but the Rockets on point, Cypher! No way out. And Cypher, unfortunately, is significantly down again in less than one minute. He's lost two champions. So Cypher, gotta keep his head calm, gotta stay level. Here we go into the LG in midair. Surely. Oh, 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 oh my oh, word. His Dyro will try and speed things up, and again, it, it was a big play to make. Dyro would have seen that both have given him the fight, but unfortunately, was not able to get him. It feels like the entire round is just so consistent. The first frag, Cypher gets caught on the jump pad. And that's why Razy's now looking to be really aggressive. I would not be surprised if he dedicates this fight all the way because he has no reason not to. Cypher tries so hard to get away, but the rocket jumps chase him down. Cypher did an unsurvivable position. And he's going to be eliminated here. The next match that we're going to be having, guys, is going to be Cooler versus Razy. We saw that uh, at, the, well, I think it happened at ESWC. I don't believe we actually saw the series, but it was quite one-sided from the, the scoreboards uh, in favor of Cooler. However, it was a group game. I was that describing was earlier, in comes Razy. Shield popped. Cooler managed to evade him. It's on the orb, but not for far.
Wagner well, made it look easy. He does need that shield back. He might stick around and just go with the lightning gun. He's hitting so well. Easy and instantly a lot of heavy elder damage coming out. Cooler! Wow. As Isaac's coming back up in a second, he's going to find Cooler. Misses the shot. Mega's up in a second. There is an orb, but look at these rockets. It's absolutely glorious from Razy. The dual lightning gun. He sees the dual with you. That side, Cooler pushed off. Up the bounce path. That is going to be Razy with map one. Yeah, that's it. Razy taking the first map. That's what I would have expected to happen too, but now we will be moving into cooler spec. Yep, we're going to Bruins. We've seen that at BGL, so well. Uh, cooler just running down the clock on this one, but in comes Razy. Cool LG. Wow. Now Cooler won. Champion in the lead. What? <laughs> Crazy. The reflex is unbelievable. We've got five seconds until their heavy's up. It's going to have some presence over here. Cool. Oh, it's going to have to deal with the totem a little bit. It has to do a lot of extra damage given that the heavy was taken by Razy. He wants to chase oh. and the rail is fantastic. That's going to be round one for Razy. Razy could get the reverse sweep in round two. The point blank shotgun. His reflexes are on point. Second he's cornered, he drops down that totem, gets himself that extra HP, ready to take the fight. Nice oh, no! No! I, I think he missed his jump to go on the, along the, the upper pathway. <laughs> <laughs> Razy's like, yeah. He gets a, Razy gets a good rocket, Cooler gets a good rocket, Cooler secures now the mega health. He's taken both the major items. Razy's just biding his time. Oh my god, he does the totem damage as well! Direct rocket into totem. That is going to be Razy taking it 3 1, and he wow. gets into the winner bracket final of his group. Just about to jump into our final game of the day. It will be Razy versus Cypher once again. Second showdown of the night. Oh, what a. Here we go. This is now the third round of this match. That oh damage! God. Oh, oh my god, god. Cypher is gonna have to retreat. Oh. Out comes the dual nails! And the machine gun will be enough to wrap it up. Cool, but just swap position. Yeah, pretty much. They just uh, they both went for the same thing. Had an orb ready to back up if need be, and they did just that. Cypher, yeah. one rail, two rails. Now the, the, the reason, there's a reason he swapped the shotgun, but the train is actually blocking off significant oh. shots. And how did that <laughs> trade? He just needs to get one shotgun blast, but crazy, just using the staircase. Yeah, yeah. This could be it. This could be Cypher's revenge. He has to get to escape damage now to what? Well, well, well. How? Well, Razy. well, well. Razy came into that fight with such an advantage. He had the positional advantage. He had the stack advantage. And Cypher just turned around and said, no, it ends here. This is my map. Get out. But that, that's what they always say, right? When you feel like you have an advantage, you've always got to factor in the accuracy of the player, their aiming ability. And if it's Cypher with an LG and dual wield, it doesn't matter if you've got full stack, overstacked health, overstacked armor, you still got to show so much respect. Because when Cypher is down, he is one of the best Quake players of all time for a reason. Well, here we go, guys. This could be our final map, the Veil of Nath, Cypher versus Razy. They're going to be trading the dual wield right now anyway, trying to go for those rapid fire rails. Razy very bravely giving himself that cipher. It's Razy's keel right now, though. He's got to be very careful. He's going to use the orb. Oh, oh my oh. god, the damage! And heavy picked up as well, but now he's down to 31 points of health. There's not much he can do, and Razy! What a read by Razy! Razy getting that frag, and he might find another one right here. Cypher, can he get back out? He doesn't need to, he's just going to stick it out. Oh for my Cypher, he's God. got almost no health to his name, 10 points of health, no armor whatsoever. And meantime, Razy, fully stacked, one more tickle of LG will... Oh, that real Cypher, so ballsy. Oh, and try and get some damage off of him now. If he goes through the teleporter, he will note on here and see Razy too. LG versus LG, dual wheels coming out on both sides. Five press more stack, that's what Razy's got to be worried. Oh, and he gets oh. knocked away! That was so clean! Unfortunately, has not really had the best of time with this champion on this map so far. And it's a tall order to expect him to just make a comeback here, especially when Razy's hitting rails like that. No. It's going to get undone, and there it is! Veil of Nath goes into the favor of Razy. This is danger territory for Cypher, but only one of these players is making it to tomorrow's playoffs, and whoever loses this map is out of the tournament for good. 25 seconds to go. I don't think Cypher has the slightest clue of where his opponent is at right now, but here we go, Cypher dropping down! Wow. Yeah, I mean, we're, this is such a crucial round that neither of these players wants to give up a bad fight. Oh, oh he misses it!
Cypher's gonna be a little bit nervous now. Yeah, oh, in he pushes, though. Oh. And final map, final round for the final matchup of the day. Who will take it home? Who will make it into day two? Will it be Cypher or will it be Razy? This is Stress City. Uh. One round and one player's going home. Razy's popping his dual wheel, but Cypher has the stack advantage, absolutely. Uh. Tries to go for the sniper, the SMG, but Razy's taking so oh. much damage, but they get the train! Cypher's gotta be careful though, he doesn't really have the stack to take any sort of close quarters fights against Razy, and that might just be what happens, Razy pushing in mercilessly, oh. but in doing so he is sacrificing some stack, that's a good opening rail, this might be Cypher's opportunity, we another one, one, one more will do it, he's gonna rocket jump up, but a bit too late, had he done that a second earlier he would have gotten himself a frag probably, he just doesn't know where he's, he just does not know where Razy is retreating, he's playing this defensive game so well, and he's running out of time, 40 seconds on the clock, Cypher, you gotta make something happen now, mate. I know it's easier said than done here, but this is your tournament point. He's so close. Cypher closing the gap. Oh, he gets a teleport on the orb. He has to try and head him off, but it's it's one side of the map or the other. I really feel like this is gonna be impossible. We're on the verge no. now. Razy taking him out. Two seconds left. Razy has done it. A hard fought <laughs> match. Cypher is gonna be eliminated from this tournament, and he just, just couldn't catch it. You made it into the final four, so not only, of course, are you in the prize money, you now have one of the tickets to Dreamhack Winter as well, and tomorrow you're going to be playing for all the marble. You're up against other titans of the game tomorrow, the matches are only going to get harder from here, but congratulations, you've made it, you're where it counts at the end of the day. Ladies and gentlemen, Razy, our fourth and final player, through to the semi-finals tomorrow. We'll be back here on this stage in the morning to bring you the first one of those in the double elimination day two. Well, here we are moving into the first game of the day. It is Razy and Kilson quickly getting their PCs on the stage. I'm trying to think of a prediction of myself. I'm, I'm feeling this could go any way. The only reason I'm looking a teeny bit more to Razy is because he had all the matches yesterday to kind yeah. of get himself used to it all. See our boy Kilson up on the screen as Joris I mentioned. He took the trophy last year. I'm sure he's gunning for it once again twice in a row. Oh my god, the lightning gun from Crazy! he should be able to defend it. Yeah, razy has got solid control right now, and Kilson goes up to bounce, but this sounds like oh, a misplay. Crazy shouldn't be aware of this, Kilson looking for some rails, but we've got a drop down, we've got the dual wheel, no all for a second, and Crazy, he turns the round back on his head. Here we go, he finds Razy. Oh, he doesn't have his ability yet, oh, there comes there we the go. rail, Kilson taking map one, make it over to Mega, but there comes the orb from Kilson. Mega will be going to the German. This is a bad spot to be in for Razy. He's just gonna push in mercilessly. Gilson oh, will go down. Razy knew that the orb had been used because as soon as he saw that uh, orb getting used, he hit the rail. He's like, well, I can push in now. Two great rockets. Oh. There's the closer. <laughs> just a little bit. There's the jump. Gilson, he could get crushed right now. This rocket to LG. That is gonna be first blood of the round for Razy. He will. Out comes the double LG. But Razy looking super solid. But Gilson will be taking the heavy this time around. And there he comes, the German landing so much damage, but the, the Mega is right there for him at just the right time, and Razy will oh. survive and even convert. What a great LG. The border down there, Gilson immediately catching Razy right there. And here we go, this could be converted into first frag. Razy's rockets are huge, and he wow. has a totem to work with still. I mean, that was unbelievably good for Razy. Orb comes in, it misses out. Now he wants to pounce, he wants to take one more kill. Send us over to Corrupted Keep in a minute and a half or less. He runs right back in, Frail. Never mind, it's gonna go into the lightning gun and there it is. Oh, jumping into the deciding map of this series. Who is it going to be, Kilson or Razy? Off the round, he's gonna find him out in the middle. There's the dual wheel, there's a totem down. He's just gonna get rid of one yeah. rocket and Four. rams out the LG for last 46 second round for Razy. Push into him. Good oh. read from Gilson, but wow, oh, Razy! Basically, and Gilson is just pushing in unexpectedly, trying to take these frags off of Razy, but now the heavy for him. Razy's gonna hear him coming. He's oh. gonna drop anyway. He does he does get the armor, but he's so low on life that Kilson takes him down, takes the W, and will meet either Rafa or Claws in the winner bracket final. But let's take a quick look at the brackets on screen. So Kilson beats Razy 2 to 1. We saw that just a few minutes ago. That now means we move on to the lower bracket. One of the players in the match that you are about to see will bow out of the tournament at this stage. Whoever wins this moves on to face off against either Kilson or Rafa, so there could very well be a rematch here yeah. one way or the other. We're going stuck in here, Maestro Gaming Team kill one way or the other, Razy and Claws.
me, the player wants to be eliminated a little bit more defensive. And he's oh. to do that against all oh, the instant dual wield. Yeah, of course, the LG pushback is determined by how much damage that you do. And two, that's oh. more than one, but what a combo from Razy. And now he's at such a good opportunity because he got a kill just before the major item spawns. But Claus doesn't want to commit just yet. Rail, which kind of gives him that combination of rail and piercing sight. One of the best combinations in the game, without a doubt. And Claw's actually baiting Razy and taking heavy, but unfortunately for him, the heavy is exactly what allowed that fight to go in his favor. And Razy looking really strong and awoken right now. Yeah, very good use of the orb right there. I'm not surprised to see him take that until we yeah. right back in. Razy ambushes him a little bit with the LG. The surprise on the rocket as well. Excellent choice. It's Sarah Claus was not expecting Razy to still be there, and that allowed him to get that first frag. Good opening rocket, and another one to boot. And Razy will find the frag on Claw. Awesome. And Claws is being consistently surprised here. It's exactly what happened with Rafa. And when yep. Rafa was oh. able to destroy Claws on this map just a few minutes ago, it was based on the same plays, and Claws yes, must have been feeling like he had the upper hand. Down the first map, and this was actually Claws' map pick. And Razy took it so convincingly, too, as we are about to move in to corrupt the keep Razy's game. Caught off guard for the second time in this map. Gets a fantastic rocket, needs a little bit more than that, but he should be able to turn the momentum, which he does. 27 HP, make that 55. To make the best of comebacks happen, but we're gonna get a confrontation right here. Claws up against two LGs, and that will prove too much for the Belarusian player. He's trying to refrag for the time, and it just isn't really working. Razy with another catch for speed that he wants to satisfy that itch to scratch, but it's really not paying out for him. He's going through the teleporter just like with right the heavy here. nail gun, and he's gonna try for it. Wonderful rocket. He's gonna move Razy out. A bit of a dangerous distance. Oh, the all or nothing. Not only mistiming the heavy by a split second, but not having the ability oh. to fight back, and is that game over? Yep. Oh, and if Claws wasn't gonna die there, he was gonna be ring out anyway. But up next, it's another big one. It's going to be the eternal rematch. Kilson and Razy will be going head to head for another time. Can Kilson maintain his winning streak versus Razy? Or is Razy going to tie things up some and get the rematch and that one way ticket to a grand finals with Rafa? We're going to have a cracking lower bracket final here. One of these players is now going to be going to the grand final. And this next best of three will determine exactly who that is. In terms of predictions, who knows? Um, you, you'd almost go as far to say that you think that whoever wins this loser's bracket final is going to, at the very least, before they even get a chance at fighting Rafa, cement themselves as the number one dueler in this part of the region. Yeah, because you sure. look at everyone that was in this bracket, everyone that you would kind of put in the runnings is pretty much here. Um, Kilson, though, and Razor, do you have a, um, a prediction? Are you going to go with what we saw last time? Or? My prediction is that Kilson, I don't think that his loss against Rafa is going to phase him too much. Switch now as Kilson's gone into the visor the first time we've seen the visor oh. today. Oh god! The combo boys! Let's go! That was a valiant attempt for Kilson understanding Razy was gonna chase him down from up top, which gives him guaranteed damage and just another rocket. And right there does not want to take a direct. He knows he's in a really bad angle for it. And ah, doesn't quite get the rail either. The problem he's have is now he's re-entered. There is no dual wheel, but he still has less sack. The rocket doesn't come through. Oh. Doesn't get the rocket he was looking for. He just needed one oh more shot god. on the floor. Oh, it's a rocket, dual wheel, there's the, there's the, well, never mind. <laughs> no oh. one what I was going to say. <laughs> He's looking so good over there. His game sense on the small map, so knowing when to go with the rocket. Some of the best rockets in the business for Razy dual wheel shotguns. Can he finish the job? Oh, stop. That was so sick from him with the shotgun. Razy might try to chase this one up. Kilson dropping down. That mega health is not up for absolutely ages. Unless Kilson's just going for it. He has a lot of weaponry to try and take this fight, but unfortunately with that dual wield, yeah, that's a quick turnaround. Going in for the BJ first, but Razy means that he catches Kilson out of position like he did just there. Wow, okay. He can try and get some advantage and spring a trap that was not really equipped to deal with. Popping his own dual wield, but so much damage has been done. Grabbing the gauntlet, because to be honest, that weak, that was his best chance at doing damage. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh god, that hurts, that hurts. Oh. it stings so bad. So there's, there's a bunch of players right at the top. They take games off each other, but not who can handle the pressure. And it's given time. Razy, he holds uh, his yeah. ground. Wow, wow, the grenade, they hurt a lot. He's gonna get the shotgun blast. He needs to try, Ooh. but he can't finish the job. Just stole away the light armor too, in order to deny as many things as possible. Another light armor's been taken. He's got to hunt Kilsa down, and he's just found him. That's gonna be it. We're going over to a map three. Right on the line here. Absolutely. Fun. 
trying to go for the long range drive off to keep him at arm's reach, but the issue is that he's been unable to really keep much from Razy. His stack can be undone, Whoa! but they trade! Rocket versus LG, both kills are out of there. Trading heavy machine gun for Tribolt, again, relatively even damage. This has been such an immense back and forth. And going in for the dual wow. wield, but just can't get the money Another shot. Another champion eliminated for Kelson. We could be having Razy on match point in a few short moments. But the longer Razy manages to adapt this style and catch Kelson off guard, the more frustrated oh. it's going to make Kelson such a chunky boy, hard to take down, and he has to really watch out. Can he land the rocket? Has oh! The no, Razy gets the return of the nails, and Kilson himself cannot believe it just like that. Razy, he's going through to the grand final right now. He gets redemption here in the loser bracket final. Unbelievable performance from him. He managed to avoid going to that 2 2 situation on Vale. Such an exemplary performance from Razy, and even a sigh of relief then from him. And it is now time for the grand finals of the Quake Champions Duel Invitational. We have two incredibly talented players, one of whom who's put in an absolutely imperious performance in the upper bracket to sweep his way all the way to the grand finals. The other, a story of Graf shifting his style and doing whatever it takes to get those Ws against all manner of opposition. He has definitely earned his place here, but will have to come through two best of threes to lift the trophy. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome for the last time to the stage, it's Rafa and Razy! Rafa is on the winner's side, having not lost a single series today. He only has to win one best of three. And Razy being on the loser's side means he has to win two best of threes. In essence, he has to beat Rafa twice. The first win will be putting Rafa in the loser's bracket and resetting the bracket. If we do indeed get that reset, then we actually have to go through the picks again as well. So we could see something totally different as uh, mentioned already. Oh, man, I'm excited. This is Dude. grand finals here at the Italian Esports Open. Rafa versus Razy. You wanted to see it. And by God, you got it. It's going to be a Galena mirror to kickstart things on the bail of NAF. USA versus Europe. No sustainability because of the totem putting him back up to full HP. Tries wow. to catch him on the heavy and he will be successful. LG looks so damn good over there. He's going to find uh, Kiel on the exit. LG looking decent. Grenades on the back end. Rafa is incredibly weak, so on this turbulent round, he could be about to tie it up. There it is. This is a wonderful lead to currently set on. And that was a superb rail to hit, too. That's going to force Rafa significantly far away. All right, nice. nice little turnaround of the LG. Now, now time to go further. Switches away from the rail himself, and time to get maybe a little closer. So many grenades have gone out already. Rafa's not got many left. He's hitting loads in the end, but it was a very well-calculated risk from Razy. Oh, almost! That was nasty. Yeah. Right next to him. Dual wheel's going to push him back up the bounce pad. Rocket misses. Razy still pushing forward despite all of that. How is this fight going to get concluded? Oh, oh rail! Uh, sitting. And now he's in his terrible position. That's it. Dual wield. Because of it. Oh, he's going to find him here at the top. Oh my god, the LG. Is he going to chase into this one? Mega's going to be up. He goes, oh, the rocket! What a shot, Razy, that he's got. Unbelievable. Razy has absolutely stepped up, and a fight's going to take place wow. in heavy. Rafa overextending, trying anything to take at least a little bit of control back, but doesn't work. And he gets a wonderful spawn. Here comes Razy. He just needs a few more rails, and this is going to be a reset bracket. Rafa's oh. not going to go out without a fight, but this is an uphill struggle. What a rocket. Oh. There it is, dual wield LG on the rail flick! We're gonna get a full bracket reset. Best of three. Crazy with that look of just stone faced determination. But he's gonna get that final confrontation. Oh! Rafa runs right into that rocket trying to take the heavy. Oh, the drop down, and Razy's just gonna eliminate him. There isn't. Razy's gonna break way through. Not the challenge here. Dual wield, Rafa's gonna have to fear, and he's gonna oh go God. down. Mega in Razy's hands. He's one frag away from putting himself in match point in the grand final. Oh, jump up. Dual wheel comes out. Rafa solo. We could get a map reset in just a oh. second. That is it. Razy. Map advantage, should I say. He's 1 0 up. He's a single map away catch up from taking this final from the lower bracket. 
Succulate the items again. Oh, the rail just out of reach. Around the corner. There's the shot. That is going to be frag one of the round. Two of them super fast. Oh, oh my word. Oh my word. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, I got the rockets ready. I know he's hovering right around me. There's a good rocket with the LG tracking him down. Surely he's going to be around in a second, chasing him over out the rails of shit. That's the timing. Or he pushes through the teleporter. Both players getting pretty low at the moment. It's an amazing rocket from, from Rafa. He's trying to get it through the grates a little bit. Razy, is he going to go for the mega health? He gets chased down a bit, but Razy oh lands. We go to a tiebreaker round here. Outright, he has taken yeah. out so many amazing players to even reach this point. Rocket jump up, he's going in for this. He's doing a lot of damage. One health left, and the rail at the end! Oh my god. Oh my word. Goes up, teleporters used a couple of times. He's looking to try and close this one out. Where's that last angle? There it is! He a rock and a hard place. He is one champion away from tournament elimination. Oh, and Razy, the turnaround on dual wield is too real. He's still got stuff left in the tank. Plenty more where that came from. Rafa is on the lifeline here. Razy spells blood. Can he oh. get out of what is going on, Zeus? There's still a champion left for Razy. He knows he's got to come up with something. I think we could go to sudden death here. Having Razy run away from Rafa, but I feel like he's going to turn momentum a little bit. Here comes the teleporter entrance. The teleporter goes off, and the totem's going to do damage. Rafa, he's so weak indeed. Can he land the miracle shot here? LG, here it comes. Can he finish it off, Razy? Finish the job. Everything he needs. Rafa misses the final rail, and Razy hits the final rocket to be the champion of the Italian Esports Open. Razy began his Quake Champions journey as. Uh, a newer player that had nowhere near as much Quake experience as the rest of the competition. And through a year and a half, at this point close to two years of constant solid play, he has climbed, from this tournament, he has climbed to the very top, both online leaderboard and offline performance. Rafa said this was a way to settle the score, and I think Razy has more than Just done that. It. Both online and offline, this kid is 100% good. And it's this. not like he played Rafa in the, earlier in the winner bracket and had to come back and do it again. The only time he met Rafa at this tournament, he beat him twice on the trot. And think of the results that he's had recently. He's beaten Claws, beating Kelsey, the amount of times he's beaten Cypher lately. I, I, I mean, what are these results telling us? This guy's a king, this guy's here to stay. That was incredible. Thank you. I don't really know what else to say. I'm just very happy and very overwhelmed, very depleted and most of all very happy again. Well, I hope you've got just the tiniest bit of strength left in you because it gives me great pleasure to say you are the champion of the Italian Esports Open 2018. See that there, mate? That's yours. Literally hear people talking. We're, we're getting cock blocked at the we, moment. We, we are getting massively <laughs> cock blocked. I'm going to be completely honest. I'm going to be completely honest. This this good. delay in the room is completely messing me up. Can we do this whole portion again, please? Yeah, let's let's restart. Okay, restart the final. No, we're all good.